Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today I'm starting the video where I'm organizing my entire house. I filmed a video just like this last year and it's crazy how bad I need to organize again. So I'm gonna take you guys through all the different rooms. Today I'm starting with my bathroom and my makeup and I'm hopefully gonna get this done over like a span of like maybe two, three days. So I hope you guys enjoy. If you like organizing videos, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and I hope you guys enjoy. First of all, I just have to show you you what I'm starting with you guys I have collected so many products over this past year and this I blame this drawer on Miss Elena this is the drawer that she comes to every single day and she comes in here and she just throws stuff and just messes it all up it is a disaster and this looked so good before so what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna take all the stuff that I usually use on a normal everyday basis and I'm gonna put it in here where she can't reach it that is what i'm planning on doing may the organizing begin Now I'm left with all of my hair and body care and then some travel bags. Have my crest white strips back there and my diffuser that I'm not currently using. So much, much better. I have all my daily products that I use on my, for my skincare, hair care, and for Elena's hair all here where she can't reach it, which is perfect. And then I've already organized like Elena's shampoo, body wash, lotion, and then like nail stuff there so that is what it's looking like it looks so good the drawer she normally opens she's gonna be like what the heck is this but i just have some hair towels baby washcloths and like the little makeup eraser she can't really make that much of a mess anymore <laughs> we are gonna get started on my pantry which i feel like i do this with you guys every year but let's just see what it is looking like it's not actually that bad but i definitely need to just declutter so let's get started Wanted to show you guys the after. Just looks a lot neater. I got rid of a ton of food that was expired. I'm just happy to have this cleared out.
It's actually a few weeks later. I realized I didn't show you guys the finished result with some of the kitchen items, so I thought I would share that. And then today we are decluttering my closet, making more space for the new year. So let me show you guys some of these drawers. This has been one of my favorite things that I've done. I have my plastic wrap and my foil in this container, and it makes it so easy because it has these little cutters that go along with it, so it just makes getting them and then cutting it so easy. And then I have two for my plastic baggies. This doesn't look that organized because I do have my juicer and stuff down here and just some stuff that I don't have room for anywhere else but this little system right here has been amazing because I have a little drawer now for my dishwasher pods this is so convenient because this is like right next to my dish dishwasher over here and then I have my little sponge heads and then all of my sprays in this little container has just kept everything feeling so much more organized I think I showed you guys this organizer last year when I first got it and I just kind of like wiped it down got everything clean again and I'm still obsessed with this and it will fit in most drawers I will have all my organization stuff linked in the description box this closet always gets just packed to the brim so today we're gonna be going through and just decluttering stuff that I don't need anymore and making this look a lot better so let's get started This looks much, much better. We were able to clear out a ton of space back here and we are donating a bunch of stuff on my Poshmark, so I'll have that linked below. feels so good to have my closet cleared out. I have one more organization project that is not going to go in this video. It's more like a long-term thing. That is like organizing and getting all the baby stuff ready. I don't know if I need to be doing that at this house or if I need to be waiting until we move in because I'm not sure if where the baby's going to be here in this house or if we would have already moved and if we don't have to worry about it, we just do everything at the new house. That's like a work in progress trying to figure out. All of my baby stuff is in storage. If the baby's going to be born while we're here, then I need to get it all out and organize it all we will see but one other little project i am going to work on is changing out the wallpaper in here it's a peel and stick so it's super easy to take off not as easy to put on i mean it's definitely some work but I'm just like a little bit over the whimsical vibes. I want something a little bit more dainty and subtle. I think it's supposed to be here this week, so I'll do that with you guys. We also need to start getting ready for our trip to Umrah, which is coming up in a couple of weeks, and I cannot believe that we're gonna be leaving, and I'm gonna be so sad to leave Elena. I think it's only gonna be a week. I think we've left her for a week when we went to Banff. But it's still really hard, especially as she gets older. It like gets harder for me to leave her than it was when she was a baby. I don't know why. One of my goals for 2023 is to hit a million subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed and you watch my videos all the time, then it would mean the world to me if you would hit the subscribe button. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all in my next one. Bye.